Hello, today we embark on an exciting journey back in time to explore the sitcom Love Thy Neighbor. I'm sure many of you have fond memories of this classic show. Love Thy Neighbor is a timeless gem that has left indelible mark on television history. Join us as we relive the magic, revisiting those with the entire cast of then and now. We will explore the names and initial ages of the talented actors on the show and witness their transformation in 2024. So, without further ado, let's dive into the world of Love Thy Neighbor. Tony Aitken was born in 1946 in the sitcom he plays Eddie's Mate. In 1973, when he was in the sitcom, he was 27, and now he's 77. to start charging your rent. Yeah, mates' rates, obviously. Who said we were mates? <laughs> Ooh, chicken and ham. How come nobody makes me any pie? Tommy Godfrey was born in 1916 in the sitcom he plays Arthur. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 56, and sadly he passed away on June 24th, 1984, at 68. The whole congregation dancing naked round the font. <laughs> I should put his connections up. <laughs> Got the mother-in-law staying with us. Ah, oh, how'd you get on well with her then? She's never forgiven me for marrying her daughter and I've never forgiven her. Jack Smathers was born in 1932 in the sitcom he plays Eddie Booth. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 40 years old and sadly he passed away on February 16, 2022 at the age of 89. Supposed to be realistic. Realistic rubbish. Good God Almighty. I mean, no, but not ordinary people don't swear every time they open their mouths, do they? Yeah. Hey, out, I may have dodgy eyes, but still I've got a heartbeat. I'm sure that your nephew can help you out. He works in Scotland. Come on, I've been thinking about. Keith Marsh was born in 1926 in the sitcom he plays Jacko. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 46, and sadly he passed away on January 28, 2013, at the age of 86. Jacko, come on, sock it to me. You what? Ten days I've been away, not once have I heard it. Come on, come on, come on, let's have it. Oh. I love her. <laughs> 75 years he's worked here. 75? Are you sure? Yes, why? Well, that would mean he was in nappies when he was set on. <laughs> Rudolph Walker was born in 1939 in the sitcom he plays Bill Reynolds. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 33, and now he's 84. Lovely, Bill! <laughs> Have you really bought it? Uh, uh, only the front wheels, the rest is on HP. <laughs> <laughs> you know, at a time like this, I imagine you've got to thank your mother, your father, your uncle, your aunt, your wife, your children. Kate Williams was born in 1941 in the sitcom she plays Joan Booth. In 1972, when she was in the sitcom, she was 31, and now she's 82. See you, don't you? No, go on, tell me. Because you've got a big backside. <laughs> Thank you very much. It's true, love. They're all the same. They... Pork luncheon, mate. Oh, then I can't. <laughs> I'm Jewish. <laughs> don't worry about that. I bought that in the world of quid. This... Frank Williams was born in 1931 in the sitcom he plays Mr. Martin. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 41, and sadly he passed away on June 26, 2022, at the age of 90. Oh, isn't it first come, first serve? Quite right, sir. Then it's mine, eh? I'm afraid not, sir. <laughs> That's it, mate. Us whites must stick together. It's mine, then. It's nobody's yet. To a large extent, because I'm beginning to have some mobility problems. And when we did the last series of Dad's Army, I remember... George Roderick was born in 1913 in the sitcom he plays The Removal Man. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 59, and sadly he passed away on March 10, 1976, at the age of 63. You must come round and meet the wife. Hey, hang on, mate, you got the wrong man. I'm just a furniture remover. Pardon? I'm not the one that's moving in here. Look. Nina Baden Semper was born in 1945 in the sitcom she plays Bobby Reynolds. In 1972, when she was in the sitcom, she was 27, and now she's 78. Do you think this one's funny? 
a white fella said to his black friend, why do you wear white gloves in the cinema? And the black friend said, so that... Edwin Apps was born in 1931 in the sitcom he played the role of Captain. In 1972, when he was in the sitcom, he was 41, and sadly he passed away on April 16, 2021, at the age of 89. Onward Christian soldier, <laughs> good and loud. Onward Christian soldiers, one, two. Paul Ludi was born in 1932 in the sitcom he plays Nobby Garside. In 1973, when he was in the sitcom, he was 41, and sadly he passed away on January 12, 1985, at the age of 52. They're dueling pistols. Who are you going to have a duel with? Nobody. The billionaire family is these. I thought I'd hang them up behind the bar. Anyway, what you have? Dick Bentley was born in 1907 in the sitcom he plays the White Vicar. In 1973, when he was in the sitcom, he was 66, and sadly he passed away on August 27, 1995, at the age of 88. The are in no position to cast the first stone. At this very moment, the statue of our patron saint above the door has a notice hanging round his neck. Ken Perry was born in 1930 in the sitcom he plays Cyro. In 1973, when he was in the sitcom, he was 43, and sadly he passed away on December 5th, 2007, at 77. And he knows nothing, that fella, you know. He used to be a window cleaner before he owned that garage. I mean, two hours labor charge for changing the sparking plug. When we reflect on the incredible journey of Love Thy Neighbor that took place between 1972 to 1976, Witnessing their growth and transformation, we can see that the connection from those years left a lasting legacy. Their story continues to resonate with fans around the world. And as always, show some love, hit the like button, subscribe for more, and hit the bell to never miss my new content.